So you want to flash Bradby to a Hubson X4, but do it really quick. Okay, so this is what you're going to need. You're going to need all of these files over here, except for this one. You can get rid of that. So basically, what you're going to want to do is head over to these five links over here and download their products. One's going to be the driver for the ST link. The other one's going to be the MD um, Kyle Uvision software. The other one's going to be the legacy support pack. The other one's going to be, I don't know what. One's going to be the the tool for erasing the, the firmware on the Hubsend, and the other one's going to be Bradby for the Hubsend. So, bam, have all that done. Okay, you're going to have all of these files over here. You're going to want to extract these zips into folders over here. So now that you've done that, you're going to want to install the driver. You can do that by going into here, and then either selecting one of these two, depending on one of your uh, whether your system is 32 or 64-bit. So after that's done, you're going to want to install Kyle Uvision. I'm already done that. Um, when it comes to packs, you're going to want to install the new vision pack for the micro uh, M054ZDE or ZAN, depending on whether your Hubsend is version 2.2 or 2.3. So after you've done that, you're going to want to run this file over here, which is going to add legacy support for how to flash your how to flash the chip. After you've done that, you're going to want to open this file here, SWD Hacking Master, Kyle Flash Tools. You're going to want to open this one here in the Uvision. So once you're there in Uvision, what you're going to want to do is go over to uh, hit debug and then uh, enter in the command, hit enter, and then a window is going to pop up and you're going to press um, those four little buttons that are labeled one to four in the picture. So great, after you're done that, your Hubson will be erased. Careful because this can brick it. So next thing you're going to want to do is install Bradby. So you're going to go here, Bradby Master, and then install Bradby X4 UV Proj. So after you make sure that everything is all set up, your device is uh, set up, and that you're using the right debugger, you're just going to go here, hit load, and you should be good. That's it.